Hi and hello. Good to see ya. We've got the Roxy Turvey Ipsy Vase Box. I guess it used to be a base box. Now it's just Boxy Turn by Ipsy. Anyway, we have what we got for February, and it looks yummy. <laughs> let's take a look. Yes, let's. We are starting with a product by Eloise, and this is one of my three choices. This is by Eloise. It is in the shade Ruby, and it is a lip oil, and it smells like watermelon. And you know I love me some good watermelon. So I'm excited to put this one in the lineup. If it doesn't get used in the winter, it definitely will get used in the summer. This next item is from Dallas and James, and it is a serum. And I like that bling. Yes, this is a nice packaging. And as near as I can tell, those little gold flecks move around in there. How cool is that? So that is the Dallas and James Watermelon Dream Clarity Serum. And yes, it smells a little like watermelon. Another reason that I picked it. And where did it go? Where are we here? It has got glittering drops of salicylic acid, hyaluronic acid, niacinamide, and it's good for decongesting pores while locking in hydration, improving your skin barrier with ceramides and squalene. And another reason, in addition to the fact that it involves watermelon, another reason I picked this is in my lotion or face cream lineup, I have a product that is also like watermelon. So my thought was I can put the two of these together when the time comes for them in the lineup and be able to use two from the same brand and see how that works. It's always nice when that works out. Yes, it is. And then from context, we have a nice looking pink lip lacquer. Yes, and this is in the shade Say Love. I hope I got that right side up. Maybe I didn't. Maybe it's upside down. Oh, well, in any case, it's a nice pink shade. I just need to sort through all of your products and decide if I should be keeping this or if this is something I can share in a future giveaway. It is a nice shade though. Yes, it is. We are halfway through the box and Anne has picked out her two favorites. Yes, from the three choices that I get to make, I think my top two would be the watermelon scented products both the serum and the lip oil. What did you like? Do you get this box? Comment down below and let me know. I'm a nosy camel. I want to know all the details. Tell me everything. And now moving right along with this video. Next up is something that Anne paid for with her points. Yes, you earn points by doing reviews on their website. And so I use some of my points to get a Ciate London Primer. This is the Vitamin Boost Plumping Primer. I'm not a big primer person, yet I am finding that Ciate London, uh, I'm going to call them face products, um, the setting powder, and the under eye brightener, I am finding that her brand and I get along nicely. So I wanted to give this a try. So I thought this was a good use of my points. Then Ipsy, or Roxy Charm by Ipsy, I guess I should say, does two of the choices 
based on your profile. And based on my profile, one item I got is from Grown Alchemist, and this is a day cream. And I can't get in there because it's got a really tight safety seal. It's a type of safety seal where, I don't know how well this shows up, there, there's a point inside the outside of the lid that you use to poke into the safety seal. So I'm going to presume that this is a nice scent or unscented. So I'm going to add this one to my lineup and see how it goes. And in any bitty little print on the box, it says that this replenishing and comforting cream supports the moisture barrier throughout the day and leaves the skin feeling intensely hydrated, formulated with niacinamide, echinaceas, and mushroom. And I used many, I'm going to say many years ago, when I first started my channel, I tried a water mushroom serum. That stuff was wonderful. I believe it was by Volition. So if this has a mushroom in it, I'm not a big mushroom eating fan, but I'm willing to use it on my face. The other item that was fixed for Anne is a palette. I like the outside of that. That does look nice. And there is the inside. This is an Ace Beauty, Ace Butte, Ace Beauté. I've heard it pronounced all different ways. That is what it looks like. And this means I get to do swatches. I need a brush. Let's get her a brush. Okay, here we go. Fatima will now do swatches from the Mystic Romance palette. As always, those were some very nice swatches. Thank you. I like swatching. We've noticed. Hey, it's fun. What did you like in the second half? I think my top two would be the palette that they picked and the plumping primer that I picked. So we're going to take a quick look at the nitty gritty, because that's what I like to do. If you'd rather skip on ahead, there'll be a video popping up at the end. Please remember to comment, like, and subscribe to our channel. And we have fun things listed down in the description box below, including a link to this box if you're interested. So, a quick look at the nitty-gritty. This box gives us five full-size items. It's around $30 a month. However, I have an annual subscription, so that brings me down to about $25 a month. Or a little bit more because you've got to pay taxes. Can't get around taxes. The shipping is free. The item that I redeemed with points was 600 points and that was the Ciate London face primer and then looking at item pricing we have the facial palette $39 the grown alchemist skin cream $62 the Dallas and James serum $42 the Lip Oil by Eloise Beauty, $30. The Contact Skin Matte Lippy, $24.
So that gives my box a grand total of $196. So I would say for the monetary investment, I got you got a good return on the value. You were going to say that you got a good return. Well, I use some of it too sometimes. Yes, from a monetary standpoint, I think this month was a very good return on the investment as well as the products. They easily cover the cost of the box, which is a great reason to do subscription boxes is you can pay a lower set price and get to try a lot of neat items. Yes, it's fun. Thank you for watching today. Like, comment, subscribe. Check out the description box down below. And we hope to see you in another video. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.